Hey guys, Brian here from Liquid Concepts. So today we're going to talk a little bit about uh, valve covers. And so we've got a customer that sent us in this, uh, this piece here. Definitely needs some love for sure. Um, this is going to be a valve cover that we've got. Um, not quite sure 100% on exactly which one it's for. I'm sure it's for one of the uh, smaller four cylinder engines, but um, either way, for us, it doesn't really matter. The main thing is that it's going to look a lot better after it leaves our shop, which is exactly what that customer wants. Um, in this case right here, we're actually going to do our favorite film, which is the carbon fiber. And so, with something like this right here, this is actually gonna be a pretty standard dip. It's not gonna be super hard. Uh, the biggest thing on this one is, is that um, we've got this recessed valley that's all the way down inside here. So um, with the carbon fiber and the stretch that you're gonna have all down in these areas like that, it's, um, we're probably, I'm not gonna say we're going to have to, but we're probably going to have to black in some of these areas down in here, mainly because inevitably the carbon as it stretches, it may not look 100% whenever it gets down in here. Also, I know we're going to trap some air with the way that this area is right here. So we're definitely going to have to um, black these in just a little bit. But um, uh, we wanted to shoot a quick little video on this and show you guys the um, start of what we've got here, which is um, definitely not ideal. I'm sure you can probably see it's been painted uh, some type of red color. Somebody's tried to um, completely sand down a lot of this and they've already done some work to it. And so they've sent it to us to of course make it look a lot better. And so that's pretty much what we specialize in. That's what we do. And we're gonna show you guys how we do it. So let's get started. All right, so we've got everything already painted and now we're ready to dip. So we've got this valve cover here and as you can see, there are a few little minor casting, um, I guess you would say errors in the casting itself. Um, so uh, we did find that after we like blasted it all completely out of there, but not a big deal. Um, this one right here, customer was still fine with it. He wanted to proceed. So we're gonna go ahead and go through give it a carbon fiber look and it's definitely gonna come out really nice. So we've got it already base coated in our charcoal gray metallic, which is exactly what we need for the film that we're gonna be using, which is of course our favorite CF-282. And um, of course, if you need to, you can check the link in the description below. We'll have a link uh, for that if you're needing that film. So let's go ahead, let's lay this film out here and let's get started. All right, so we have got everything all finished up with the valve cover and it definitely brought it back to life, makes it look like a completely different valve cover. As you can probably remember from what we showed you at first, whenever it, we got it in, it looked horrible. But uh, now looking at it, um, it definitely gave it a whole brand new life. So um, we're very excited about that. Now I will say this, there are still a few uh, manufacturing defects that was in the casting it looks like. And so of course, those are not going to be completely taken out unless you do major body work on this thing on smoothing everything out, grinding, welding, things like that. But just going from what it looked like before to what it looks like now, 
definitely a tremendous difference and I think it turned out really good. So you can kind of see here, we've got the carbon all the way around. We've went through in here and blacked in all of this area, just like what we were talking about before. And of course, now everything looks really good. And even if uh, they do use the cover, uh, you know, it still looks good whenever you give it to the customer. If they don't use the cover, then it's still going to look really well even with everything else that's already going to be in here uh, as far as the automotive parts that are needed to go in that so uh, hopefully this video has really helped you guys out if you have any questions or comments definitely leave them below we'd love to hear from you on anything hydrographic related as well as let me know your thoughts on the valve cover how it came out or anything like that definitely love to hear from you on that also, if you haven't already, definitely hit the subscribe button. We'd love to have you subscribe to our weekly tips and tricks on anything hydrographics related. I'm Brian from Liquid Concepts, and this is how we customize your world. We'll see you guys next time.